Good morning, guys. I am running very late on the Cast Iron Wednesday challenge. Today would be the last Wednesday that I could post this. So, um, I am somewhat sheltered in place. Um, I've chosen not to go to the grocery store if I don't have to. Before the pandemic really ramped up, I went and looked for stew meat. Um, the challenge is beef stew. And I was not able to find any stew meat. So, this is going to be a um, green chili stew made with hamburger meat. So, I wanted to, first of all, I wanted to share this book with you since I have um, been doing the Texas State Parks lately. Um, this book is called Weekends Away. Camping and Cooking in Texas State Parks. So, my friend Monty um, bought me this book. Thank you, Monty. Copyright is 1993. So, I've had a great time looking through here. Um, it talks about, see the different pictures. It talks about the different state parks. Colorado Bend. Um, of course, I loved reading about Possum Kingdom State Park. And... You know, things have even changed from what the write-ups in here were. But really cool. And I may talk about this book more in, in, uh, in future videos. But this is talks about all the Texas State Parks. And then there's recipes in the back. So, um, of course, I wanted to see if there was a recipe for beef stew. And there was. And it is a green chili stew. So I'm going to I'm going to use this recipe but I'm going to modify it. I'm just going to kind of add uh whatever I want, but uh I'm kind of basing it off of this recipe. So I'm going to probably be cooking a lot out of this cookbook. This is probably one of my most favorite cookbooks ever because it has to do with Texas State Parks. So I love it. Um John, uh he was a park host with me. Um he showed us this book and Monty went out and got him really fast. So I thank Monty for buying me one. But anyway, let's get on with our ingredients. Of course, you got to have green chilies. And then I'm going to use diced tomatoes with green chilies. I'm going to put a little bit of macaroni in it. Um, garlic powder, oregano, cumin, or camino. Um, I don't have any beef broth. But I do have the bouillon cubes, so I'm going to use that and some water. Onion, potatoes, and hamburger meat, which I don't have out. <laughs> and hamburger meat. So I am getting um, ready to actually go cook this in a different location. I am working on creating a portable cook set that I can take with me. And um, there'll be another video on that, so check that out. I've been collecting utensils. Actually, I got a lot of them in Arizona in January. But anyway, um, I'm going to cook this in the Dutch oven, so let's get started. Got potatoes in here with onions. I'm about to put the, look at my little meat cleaver, isn't it cute? That's a big meat, but that's not mine. Um, and get the meat on. Oh yeah, now yeah, we're talking. Got some boiling happening. I'm just gonna have to turn the pot and stir. Isn't that look like good? Yes. Mmm, <laughs> that's pretty good. I like it with the hamburger meat and a tortilla. Tortilla. Flour tortilla. <laughs> 